A very good day to you people. My name is Mohit and guys today we'll see how we can actually play video files on uh, your web page or your website. Guys the first thing that we need to ensure is that we are working with HTML5 doc type and not HTML4. Right now I have Dreamweaver CS5 open in front of me which uses the doc type the old doc type and I need to switch to the new doc type so guys let me show you the new doc type uh, there it is and the new uh, character encoding so what I need to do is I need to replace the old doc type in the character encoding with a new one so I'll go back to Dreamweaver and everything above the closing head tag I'll delete it after selecting it in fact uh, let me skip the title as well so everything above the title let me delete that after highlighting the text um, I've gotten rid of it now guys okay what I'll do is I go I'll go back to uh, notepad and uh, copy this bit say copy and go back to Dreamweaver and paste it out there alright I don't need the head closing tag I already have it out here in line number 8 so now that I have the new uh, character set and the doc type set to HTML5 I'm good to go let me switch over to the code view so I can easily explain now uh, what's uh, what's going on here so guys uh, I need to use the video tag this is the opening video tag and this is the closing video tag and uh, this should be inside the body tag this should be inside the body tag the, the video tag that is okay guys also as uh, a preparation make sure that you have the mp4 format the OGV video and the webm video that YouTube uses uh, all the three formats should be there in your local site folder in my local site folder I have the mp4 I have the webm but I do not have the OGV or the org video but in case that's okay for this tutorial but in case uh, you wish to make a complete uh, you know project you need to ensure that you should have all the three uh, video formats before you upload it to the web server okay that's one thing the second thing is that uh, you also need to have an SWF format okay so in fact we are using four formats the mp4 the OGV or the org video it could be OGG or OGV uh, mp4 and SWF okay so as a prep work or the preparation before you can actually upload it to the server make sure let's uh, have a look uh, at my local site folder okay I have the mp4 mpeg4 and also the OGV video let me right click and uh, check the properties it says webm I'm sorry I have the webm and I have the mp4 format already okay but you should ensure that you have uh, all the four formats and uh, one very good converter guys is uh, any video converter that you can uh, download from uh, filehippo.com that's f i l e h i p p o dot com a uh, very um, generous uh, website from where you can get a lot of softwares i got it from there okay what you can do is you can uh, then probably download any video from there you can just put the youtube google meta cafe or nico video you know url out here and then you can start the download or you may have uh, an mp4 format yourself and then you can convert them to let's say a webm or maybe an swf all right so you have uh, a lot of options out here okay so you can just add a video out here and then you can convert it through this button so very useful utility that i found on uh, file hippo all right let me get back to dreamweaver so let's see what's what's going on in this code guys the first thing uh, that happens here is uh, we are declaring the width and the height uh, through attributes that that have been taken inside the video opening tag okay so that will control the 
dimensions of the video that that are being played that is being played rather what controls as a attribute does here is it will give you the play pause buttons the mute buttons the volume control buttons etc etc so you get that small strip down at the bottom of the video that is responsible for manipulating how you play the video okay now these are the sources in line number 15 16 and 17 and are responsible for playing mp4 ogg or ogv as the case may be webm and uh, mp4 once again now what i've done here is i've used the video tag i've also used the object tag okay and i've also used the embed tag so this is a fallback system guys just in case this fails it will uh, you know fall back to line number 16 failing which will fall back to line number 17 failing which will fall back to line number 19 failing which it will fall back to line number 21 failing which it will display a message which says your browser does not support video and uh, that's uh, pretty rare I mean you have four formats out here SWF uh, OGG OG, oblique OGV WebM MP4 so chances are that uh, you should see the video being played and again guys I'll reiterate you need to change the doc type to HTML4 and the character encoding uh, as well okay so after you have made the changes here you just need to in the body element push this bit okay and this bit has the video tags also has the object tag and has the embed tag so the chances are that uh, it'll play very well on your uh, screen let me go to the split view and in the split view guys you can see I got a gray area out here which corresponds to the height and uh, the width okay of the video that will be played very soon I can also pass in one more attribute and that attribute is called preload okay so if I say uh, preload uh, equal to none it means that I do not want the video to preload as soon as the web page loads okay as soon as the web page loads I don't want that I don't want the video to automatically load when the web page loads I also have uh, one more uh, uh, you know attribute that I can pass is called the poster attribute I do not have a poster ready but if I had a poster ready, ready I could browse for a picture okay maybe a PNG file that will display itself as the poster for this video okay so I'm gonna say control Z and a control Z once again I do not uh, need to use the preload and the poster options I'm skipping that for now but you can try it too guys okay so finally I'm uh, going to take a preview in uh, let's say Chrome this time Dreamweaver is prompting me to save the changes which I will and guys as you can see that I can now click on the play button to play the video which it will start playing a very good day to you people my name is Mohit and guys today I'm going to talk about how to make a flash video galleries and uh, after that let me have a look up in the other browser which is uh, Firefox a very good day to you people my name is Mohit uh, and guys today I'll teach you how to alright wonderful the motion so guys I hope uh, you uh, I hope you enjoyed this video you uh, found uh, something useful I'll see you very soon with yet another Dreamweaver or uh, flash tutorial you do take uh, very good care of yourself peace